welcome to today's video. Today is Saturday. Sam and I are out to do Saturday shopping. We used to do Saturday shopping, but now there's no shopping. But we still have things that we need to get. If you're an OG member, then you might remember Saturday shopping when we used to go to the mall. We used to buy fun things. We used to have fun. But yeah, that is no longer. But we have a few chores that we have to do, and we're going to take you guys along with us. First coffee. Thank you. Okay, so we are at our first stop. Um, you guys might know that in yesterday's video, I told you Sam had a really bad day. He broke all of his tractors in his lawn tractor. He broke, what'd you break? Tell them what happened. <laughs> lawn tractor, the engine is gonna blow. So I had to shut it off, because the engine needs a new engine. And then my uh, big tractor, my yellow Kubota, decided it didn't want to run anymore either. <laughs> It's seized up. So today we are at the store and Sam's going to get himself a new lawn tractor to start cutting our lawn again. You guys know we have a lot of lawn and we need it cut so we can uh, ride our horses, especially in the outdoor arena. Alright, change of plans. They're doing, they're taking stock. They're taking stock at this store uh, and they aren't going to open till one. You'd think that they would have like two months to take stock because everything was closed down. But yeah, no, they're doing it today. So we're going to go do our next shopping and then come back oh finally they have my gum yes. holy heck that was insane so much trouble to shop okay, we are done grocery shopping waiting in line waiting in line to check out Staying six feet apart, we did it all, you guys. They gave us free water, though, and that's something. One of the reasons I like to go to that store, we go to all the stores, but one of the reasons I like to go to that store is because they sell my gum. You guys know I chew gum. I'm a gum chewer. It's because I try not to chew food, not too much food. Gum helps me with that. I also don't drink coffee, and gum helps me. Right or wrong, it helps me, and they sell it much more affordable if you buy a whole set like this, a whole pack like this. All right, let's see, you guys. That's a cute couch. All right, this is gonna be maybe one of these is gonna be our new lawn tractor. Are they all the same? They're all the same. They're all the same. You get a choice. This one, this one, or this one. You take the black one. Take the black one. All right, I like it. Super cute. I like the one in the middle. It looks bigger. <laughs> Uh, we just became the proud owners of a new lawn tractor. Sam's going to pick it up tomorrow morning. All right, so we are home. It's raining now, and the horses are outside. We're going to bring them in because they don't have any blankets on, any rain sheets on. Uh, anyway, before we go in, I, we have got all the groceries, and I got a stack of presents for the girls. They're going to be so surprised. I'm, ex I, I'm excited. I always get excited when I surprise the girls with stuff. I have a bunch of surprises. Stuff from the P.O. box and stuff we bought. You guys are going to get to see it, but first you have to go put the horses in for lunch. Give them lunch and put them in. It's cold out. You need to see it first. <laughs> no, go. Hurry up. The faster you go, the faster you can see it. Well, somebody's going to have to help. And I bought some super fun food. I bought these Pillsbury confetti cookies because tomorrow Fiona's supposed to come and give us lessons. And I like to make fun things for our trainers. I also got our usual bags of carrots for the horses. I never go grocery shopping without thinking about the horses. They love carrots. Sometimes I buy them apples, but for some reason I feel like carrots are better than apples. I don't know why. <laughs> Even Ruby came back. Ruby's like, I'm not doing it. No, I would never leave the horses just out there. I'm going to show you guys once they get moving. But the girls are out there and it is pouring. We were planning a barbecue and a fire tonight, so we got stuff to make s'mores. Did you know if you don't have any place to make a fire and cook regular s'mores, you can cook them in the oven? You can layer like graham crackers and then marshmallows and chocolate. You can do all sorts of different things. Make it like a casserole in your oven and it's super yummy. I don't know, I might try that tonight. All right, they're about to be on the move. We're the worst parents. <laughs> oh no, because... Go take care of the horses. It's cold and pouring rain. Sophie's got, is that Sophie with Chino? Sophie with Storm. Oh, Sophie with Storm. All right, here they go. They're on the move. It might not look rough out there, but it is rough. That's what happens when you have horses, though. 
Uh oh, what is wrong with you, Stormy Boy? It's, it's Finn that's being a butthead. Uh oh, Finn? <gasps> Sam, you're gonna have to go help. No, I'm not joking. Look at the rain. Oh. Run! Not you, horse. Oh, please let her be okay. Now I really do feel like a horrible parent. Oh God, Gabby, let him go if he needs to go. Look, <laughs> the girls are soaked. Sam's on the on the run. Hopefully, Sophie comes right back and takes one of those horses from her. What a brave girl! I love those girls. So proud of them. Like seriously, so proud. <laughs> There's Sam. <gasps> Gets there at the last minute after Gabby does the whole thing. Well, usually Gabby will take Storm and Chino together and she does really well. I didn't know, I don't know what happened to make her have to take Finn, but whatever it was, she was taking care of Sophie, I'm sure of it. But oh man, I feel bad. Like we should have went down. Even Ruby came running back. That's how bad the weather was out there. She came running back. Um, hmm. I wonder who was messing with the cushions. Was it you, Macy? Did you do that? Did you ruin all the cushions? Or was it our beloved Molly? Get off the couch. So the rule at our house is the dogs are not allowed on the couch. Yeah, that means you. You were a dog. It's you. It's you. It, it means you because you wreck everything. She actually doesn't. She messes things up, but she doesn't chew anything. She has so many toys. She loves her toys and she brings them onto the couch to chew them. But it's time to get down. 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 Come on. Get down. Thank you. Stay down. Look, there's a pillow on the ground. So I, uh, we stopped by the P.O. box and got a couple of packages and we bought something for the girls and I'm going to surprise them with it when they get back. I think Gabby will like it. I don't think they're going to be super in love with it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> She came back. You're covered. You're a big, huge, rainy mess. Go away. Go. And you get off the couch. Get off the couch. This stuff is not for you. Oh, oops. Stay. Stay down. You go. Go. Macy, I feel your pain. <laughs> Poor Ruby. She's literally frozen, probably. We'll get you a towel. Dry you off. Good job, though, going out there, protecting those girls, keeping them safe from those wild horses. I'm so proud of you for not running back to the house. Literally, I don't know if you guys know Ruby. Like, Ruby is the king of all dogs. She never leaves your side. She protects everybody and anyone. Like, she is the dog that you want to keep you safe, unless it's raining. If it's raining, <laughs> you're on your own. Anyways, what I was saying is that um, I don't think that the girls are going to like what we bought them. It's something that I wanted to do this year uh, for homeschool, and we haven't done it yet. We only have about three weeks left, really, three to four weeks left of homeschool. And um, so I bought it. It's something I, I wanted to do with them. I think Gabby will be amazing at it. It's something that I really wanted for Gabby specifically because... Um, it will, because it's her cup of tea, it's something that she's good at. I, something that I want for Sophie to try her hand at and see if she likes it. I believe that God get, ugh, oh, see? <laughs> get down off the couch. This is not funny anymore. Get down off, whoops, off the couch. Stay. You go away. Did you get wet? <laughs> did you know what Ruby did? What? She, wait, I don't know how to do this. <laughs> One outside of my back. <laughs> She's like, you're on your own, sister. Molly would have came with me. Yeah, but Molly. But then, I would have died then. <laughs> yeah. Well, what was happening in the field with Finn? She knows a little less, like, oh my God, we're gonna die. But it was mostly Finn. <coughs> Gabby, that was Finn freaking I know. out. Yeah. Uh, I think it's because how normally... Hey, what are you hiding? When it's like Wait. water. 
their wind, it goes like one way, so they turn their butt, but then yeah. it was coming down and they didn't like it on their head. Yeah. I want to ears, the so they're like, in. um, spinning around. Molly, that's like, my foot. Please don't look find where their butts could block their head. Oh. Oh. Or something from the wind. I'm not sure. Did you have coffee? I know. Oh, well. Um, okay. So. Wait. Yeah, we're waiting for Sophie. Um, I have something for you, too. You have something you for have me? You have no before. Aw, thanks. Open sometimes, it. Sometimes Sophie makes us fun stuff. This first. Okay. Open the letter first. All right, so she colored us some pages. Uh, coloring coloring challenge. challenge. And yours is, it's this side. Oh, so you want me to color it. Oh, I'm yeah. excited. And All right. I'm the judge. Whoever colors it best wins. Okay, that's super fun. I challenge you, Gabby. I got an elephant and you got flamingos. I love them. Well, I'm going to have the monkeys. Flamingos. Okay. All right. It's on. Put it on the table for me. And then we have surprises for you. Uh, some of the surprises are from our subscribers. Oh, Molly. Molly. I put her on the ground. Workers. Put her on the ground. She just keeps getting back up. Look at your dog. Just wait. Look at your dog. She abandoned your children. I know. <laughs> because it was raining. I look like a drowned rat. <laughs> Okay, so, who wants package number one? Me. Oh, look at that. My favorite color, one of my favorite companies. Oh. Halter Equestrian Apparel. You guys might know Halter Equestrian. They've sent us packages before. Uh-oh, hold on. Got a couple bags. Okay, um, open the letter. Just wait, open the letter. I couldn't stop because of the mud, but I didn't want to fall because I like these pants. <laughs> so... They got Halter Equestrian like, bags. These are sliding down the hill. You were sliding down the hill? Yeah, Molly stop. is more loyal than this dog. <laughs> We've had Molly for less. We've had Ruby for like two years. All right, so the bags are super beautiful. We already have another bag from them. I love them. The reason I love them is because of the colors. They're gorgeous. That's Pretty. one of my favorite colors. Oh, that's cool. Business cards. If you want their business card, you can go to their Instagram page, Halter Equestrian. Yeah, some stickers. Some stickers. Yeah. Those are yeah. cool. Can we read this after? I think it will ruin this It says, hi, Sophie and Gabby. We wanted to send you our brand new bamboo hunter tees. Ooh. Hunter tees. Bamboo. Thanks for always supporting other Canadian small businesses. We love watching your videos. We can't wait for your feedback and seeing how great they look on you both. Sincerely, Devin, Angie, Maya, Leah, and Faith. If you want your own Hunter Equestrian t-shirt, oh, you know where to find them. That is gorgeous. Oh, I love it. I love the color. Hunter, this is like one of the Hunter colors actually. Hunter jumpers, like Hunters. Um, wear this color and it's made out of bamboo. Like the little new saddle so pads. Yeah, does it match one of your saddle pads? Uh, Gabby's. Gabby's? Oh, nice. What? Gabby got the same one, just oh, a I different size. Ones. Love it. Show the front. Oh, it has a horse jumping. So I think you can get them that say jumper too, but we got hunter. Oh, we're hunters. Yeah, we're hunters. That's cool. Uh, thank you so much, Halter Equestrian, for sending us your new hunter t shirts. They are super cool. Uh, you'll be seeing them in a vlogs this summer, that's for sure. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Uh, like I said, if you are interested in your own hunter, and I think they have jumper too, uh, t-shirt, summer t-shirt, then you can check out Halter Equestrian on Instagram. This package came to the wrong P.O. box. They called us today, so if you guys don't know, there was a problem with the P.O. If you guys don't know, there was a problem with the P.O. box, and uh, we switched P.O. boxes for a day, and then we switched back, and they called us today and said, hey, like, this package has been here for you. Um, it, there was a beautiful letter on this beautiful paper that said that, that she wanted to say sorry for our loss of Stella. She was shocked to hear the bad news and that she's been thinking about us ever since. Um, she said that she really admired our heartfelt call to action to foster Sky. And she enclosed a little gift to remember Stella by. And it's from an anonymous horse lover. And then this is beautiful. Like it came perfectly preserved. It's, it feels so nice, this paper. So this is something to remember Stella by. Oh my gosh. It's stunning. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my gosh. I, 
It's a what? It should have been Gabby and you and her. Oh my gosh, it's stunning. Absolutely stunning. Let's show them. Ruby's like, let me look. It's beautiful. So this is like a needle a string art thing. Oh my gosh. Yeah, nails into there. Oh, it, this fills my heart like you would not believe. And it says Stella Bell on it. It's absolutely stunning. And it, it makes me miss her even more. And on the back has that picture of me and her with those little bit of ribs showing that made me feel so much more successful and her losing all that weight. I am going to keep that up there on our on our memorial wall. Thank you so much for that. That is so so beautiful and so heartfelt that you sent it to us. I appreciate it so much. Isn't it cool? I want us to do this. Teach us. This last one is a robot. I bought us a robot. Unicorn? Yeah, it's a Jimmu robot. It's a unicorn and we, wait, bring it back here. You have to build it. You are not, you do not have the facilities for that. <laughs> Even I don't have the facilities for that. Well, like Gabby and Sam. But we're gonna try, Sophie. We're gonna try. We're gonna build this together. And you, yeah, you're gonna build it. I mean, you're gonna help oh. us. <laughs> but yeah, and you get the app on your phone so that you can move it around and control it after it's built. Leghorn. And LED. I think that means LED, like lights. So you say LED because there's no dots. Oh, there was no dots? It's LED. Oh. Which stands for LED lights, but. Oh. Anyways, uh, we could do it today while it's raining, or we could do it on Monday for school. Today. School. I say school, school. too. Today. Is the rain stopped now? Yeah. And the sun is out? I told you, by the time we get up, <laughs> the rain will stop. Thank you. You are welcome. Uh, it was only supposed to rain for an hour, but, I mean, it was miserable out there. It was so, it was so miserable, nobody wanted to go out there. I don't think he could see with his fly mask on. You don't think he could see with his fly mask on? Because he was on? spooking. Yeah, because it got really dark. But anyway, yeah, that's what happened. When you have horses, you make some good choices and you make some bad choices. I stand by my choice to bring them in in the rain, but they probably could have hacked it for an hour. Yeah. Get down. Down. Get down. Get down. Off the couch. Let's go. Get down. Ugh. Get down. Get down. Thank you. Down. Thank you. Right. It is time to do the thing we've been waiting to do, you guys. It went from gorgeous and warm out to a freezing cold. Everything is all wet and slippery. Bought a new house Promised you heaven but it never did work out Got a new job and moved uptown I bought you everything you never questioned why All this time I waited for a Horses are going on the grass. They're all really spooky right now because of the wind. Does Chino look cold? <laughs> they don't care. Do the bottom part of the grass. I had a feeling. I had a feeling they would stop and drop exactly where they are. Look, he's got a cut on his bum. He's getting beaten oh. up. No, a cut. You guys got one hour. All the different phases and the reasons to make it all worthwhile. My best kept secret is I never loved you quite enough. 
freezing, freezing outside. I'm excited though, like the hay looks ready to us. We saw, we have seen some people cutting it. I'll show you. See how it's starting to get seeds? Uh, we measured it, it's the right height. Typically people don't cut it until you have a few days of dryness. I feel like they're cold. All the different phases And the reasons to make it all worthwhile My best kept secret is I never I feel like when we first started putting them on grass for a little bit each day that we gave them too much and I felt like they all had a bit of a belly ache. Uh, so we backed it up a bit and I feel like things have been a lot better for them. No belly aches. So we gotta be really careful with all this grass. Like there's some good grass in there. It is fresh and green. Don't be a pig. Don't be a pig. He's like, I will be a pig. So much about horses in such a short amount of time and yet there's still so much to learn. I'm thankful for all that we did learn. In the past, I think I always dreamed that our journey with horses would involve me sitting in the house while the girls did all of it. But I've really come to enjoy this journey and being an integral part of my girls and their horses. Anyway, that is it for today's video. We'll see you guys tomorrow. All the